there was an individual by the name of Henry D. At this moment, he's been there for 43 years. And he's an older gentleman that addressed me and stated, well, you always claim to be innocent. Continue living the way you're living. That's a monster. You won't ever go home. So that gave me a different outlook in life. I decided to stop what I was doing, started picking up books. I got my paralegal certificate, business management. I just started going to college, getting all, whatever degrees they offered. So I decided to change my habits completely. The way I eat, the way I think, the way I speak, the way I live. And to this day, thank God, I feel healthy. So. <laughs> These are some of the things that I decided to better myself on, to show the community, the society, that not everyone that's in prison should be lost, that there are some that are worth saving. But when I decided to change my mentality, my doors were being opened at any given time when I wanted. I didn't have to be incarcerated, as they say. I didn't have to be in an eight by 10 at all times was able to walk around the prison as I pleased, when I pleased. When a person stole something, they came to me to find it. A fight happened, they would come to me to try to defuse it. The guards trusted me by changing who I am, by being who I am, you know, getting rid of that monster and just being me. You know, letting them see that what they're accusing me of is not who I am. That's what they claim I am. Why don't you judge me for you who you see? And that's what they did. And I was literally in the front gate with the gate wide open. And I never walked out. And I was able to do that whenever I pleased. The, I say 90% of inmates claim innocence. You know, but the way I separated them is basically by what I did. A person that fights for his innocence, fights for his freedom, no matter what it takes. These are individuals that are truly fighting for their life. Well, there has to be a reason for them to fight so hard for their lives. But not everybody's innocent, trust me. <laughs>